The Australian Army has officially taken delivery of its first M1A2 SEP V3 main battle tanks, a significant step in the ongoing modernization of its armored forces. Among the newly acquired tanks, the A27702 was showcased at the Land Forces 2024 exhibition in Melbourne, representing a major leap forward in the country's military capabilities. These advanced battle tanks will replace the older M1A1 models, which were retired from service in early September 2024. The B Squadron of the 3rd 4th Cavalry Regiment, located at the School of Armor in the Pakapunyal military area, is the first unit to receive the new tanks. This squadron will play a key role in spearheading the conversion to the M1A2 SEP V3 platform. Conversion courses to train crews and maintenance personnel are set to begin soon, with soldiers from across the Australian Army expected to participate. The 3rd Brigade, based in Townsville, will be the primary operator of these new tanks. The brigade is scheduled to receive its first M1A2 SEP V3S by the end of 2024, following a period of comprehensive training and upgrades in Victoria. Earlier in 2024, 27 Abrams tanks were spotted being transported by rail to the port of Wainimi in California, before being shipped to Melbourne and transported to the Joint Logistics Unit in Bandiana. Australia currently operates 59 M1A1 Abrams tanks, purchased in 2007 to replace the aging Leopard 1 tanks. As part of a broader effort to modernize its armored force, Australia plans to acquire 75 new M1A2 SEP V3 tanks, providing a substantial boost in protection, firepower, and technological sophistication. The introduction of the M1A2 SEP V3 is a crucial component of Australia's strategy to enhance its defense capabilities in a rapidly evolving global security environment. The M1A2 SEP V3 is an upgraded version of the US-made main battle tank, offering a host of improvements in mobility, protection, and firepower. Its 120mm M256 main gun, 7.62mm coaxial machine gun, and 12.7mm heavy machine gun mounted on the turret provide formidable firepower for both offensive and defensive operations. In terms of protection, the SEP V3 includes advanced composite armor and is compatible with the Trophy Active Protection System, which intercepts incoming threats such as missiles and rockets. The tank's electronic systems have also been significantly upgraded, featuring advanced battlefield management systems, improved communication capabilities, and enhanced energy management. Additionally, embedded diagnostic systems make maintenance more efficient, ensuring the tank remains combat-ready in diverse operational environments. Alongside the new main battle tanks, General Dynamics Land Systems Australia will be responsible for the long-term maintenance and sustainment of the fleet. The support contract extends to other critical armored vehicles, including 29 M1150 assault breacher vehicles, 17 M1074 joint assault bridges, and 19 M88A2 armored recovery vehicles. These vehicles will play a vital role in enhancing Australia's deployable armored capabilities, ensuring the Army's operational effectiveness and readiness in future conflicts. The delivery of the M1A2 SEP V3 tanks marks a transformative moment in the modernization of Australia's armored forces. With superior firepower, advanced protection systems, and cutting-edge technology, the SEP V3 significantly enhances the Australian Army's ability to face modern combat challenges. As training and integration continue, the introduction of these tanks is set to bolster Australia's armored capabilities and ensure long-term readiness for the nation's defense forces.